So I have discovered some things about search sets, and what I want to say that Navisworks is a really powerful program, and it has done many things in predefined settings. So let's check it in selection tree. I want to hide it, and we know that in selection tree we can choose the object using this. Levels, uh, there's uh, categories and other things. But we have another organization of it about sets. Sets is what we have already done. We can use it, and so it's another form of organization. It's very useful to have our work very close to us. But another thing is properties. Properties is a really huge set of search sets. So here we can take, for example, the element. The element one. Uh, the element is this one. Okay. And let's take the category. Category and then walls. And now I have chosen all the walls in the model. So when Navis work is converting the model from Revit, he's making the, a lot of, a lot of search sets, and we can use it. Okay, for example, Windows, all Windows. Okay, Windows, the category Windows, the furniture. It's result of search sets. And we can use another search sets. Let's try the first item. Item, name, item, layer, item, type, item, unit, and all the other things. So these properties are not only properties. This is the huge set of search sets. And you can use it. And it's a very powerful thing. And if you need a special kind of walls, here you can take it walls parapet and you can take it. So you, only one thing you should understand that there are a lot of properties which came from Revit and you can analyze the model with predefined search sets from the selection tree. So you can understand this window and this window, and then you can analyze and get any kind of elements very fast.